Hi there. Real quick before we jump into the episode. If you enjoy this episode or any of the other episodes, be sure to give us a follow or subscribe. It would also be great if you shared it with a friend or better yet, left a review so others can know how awesome it is. Thanks so much. And now, the episode. Hey there, Press Starters, and welcome to the Press Start Leadership Podcast, the podcast about game-changing leadership, teaching you how to get the most out of your product and development team and become the leader you were meant to be. Leadership coaching and training for the international game industry professional. Now, let me introduce you to your host, the man, the myth, the legend, Christopher Mifsud. Hey there, Press Starters, and welcome back to another awesome edition of the Press Start Leadership Podcast. On this week's episode, we'll be discussing Mastering Conflict Resolution in the Gaming World, a Leader's Guide. The video game industry, characterized by rapid technological advances, tight deadlines, and passionate team members, is no stranger to conflicts. With millions of players waiting eagerly for the next best game, the pressure to deliver is intense. In such high-stress environments, disagreements are not just probable, they are inevitable. For industry leaders, effective conflict resolution becomes crucial, not just for the success of a project, but also for fostering a culture of collaboration and respect. Understanding the Nature of Conflicts in the Gaming Industry Before diving into conflict resolution, it's essential to understand the unique nature of disagreements in the video game industry. 1. Creative Differences Video games are, at their core, a blend of art and technology. Differences in vision between designers, writers, developers, and other stakeholders can lead to conflicts. Number 2. Technical Challenges With new gaming platforms and technologies emerging continuously, developers often face technical challenges that can lead to disagreements on solutions. Number 3. Tight Deadlines the urgency to release games coupled with market pressures can lead to stressful environments, escalating minor disagreements into major conflicts. Four, diverse teams. The gaming industry attracts talent globally. Differences in culture, communication styles, and work ethics can sometimes result in misunderstandings. The importance of effective conflict resolution. For leaders in the game industry, Conflict resolution is not just about addressing disagreements. It's about shaping the future of their projects and teams. Number one, maintaining team morale. Persistent conflicts can lead to decreased motivation and enthusiasm among team members, impacting productivity and creativity. Number two, ensuring project timelines. Resolving conflicts promptly ensures that projects remain on track, avoiding delays that can be costly both financially and reputationally. Number three, Fostering a collaborative culture. Leaders who handle conflicts constructively demonstrate the value of collaboration and understanding, setting the tone for the entire organization. Number four, attracting and retaining talent. The best minds in the industry seek workplaces where they feel respected and heard. Effective conflict resolution contributes to a positive work environment, attracting and retaining top talent. Strategies for conflict resolution in the gaming world. Armed with an understanding of conflicts and their implications, let's delve into effective strategies that leaders can employ. Number one, open communication. The foundation of any conflict resolution is open, transparent communication. Leaders should encourage team members to express their concerns without fear of retribution. Listening actively without immediately jumping to solutions can lead to better understanding and resolution. Number two, define clear roles and responsibilities. Many conflicts arise from ambiguity in roles. Clearly describing responsibilities ensures everyone knows their part, reducing overlaps and potential disagreements. Number three, seek mediation. In instances where conflicts escalate, involving a neutral third party can be beneficial. This mediator, whether an HR representative or an external consultant, can provide an unbiased perspective and facilitate constructive dialogue. Number four, foster a culture of respect. Promoting mutual respect, regardless of hierarchy, can prevent many conflicts. Recognizing and valuing the contributions of every team member 
irrespective of their role, goes a long way in building a positive work culture. Number five, continuous training. Regular workshops on communication, team building, and conflict resolution can equip team members with the tools they need to navigate disagreements effectively. And number six, prioritize team well-being. Stress is a significant contributor to conflicts. Ensuring that team members have a healthy work-life balance, access to mental health resources, and regular breaks can reduce the likelihood of disagreements. Navigating common conflict scenarios. To bring these strategies to life, let's explore how leaders can address some typical conflict scenarios in the video game industry. First one, creative differences. When the art team envisions a character designed differently from the story team, it can lead to conflicts. Here, leaders can organize collaborative brainstorming sessions where both teams present their perspectives. By understanding the reasons behind each vision, a middle ground, often superior to the initial ideas, can be found. Next, technical disagreements. Suppose the development team is divided over two potential game engines. Instead of pushing a top-down decision, leaders can encourage prototyping on both engines, followed by evaluation based on performance, scalability, and compatibility. Cultural misunderstandings. With global teams, misunderstandings due to cultural differences are common. Leaders can organize intercultural training sessions, fostering awareness and appreciation of diverse cultures. Celebrating various cultural festivals or recognizing international holidays can also build team unity. Conflict prevention, a proactive approach. While resolving conflicts is crucial, leaders can take a proactive approach to minimize potential disagreements. And here's how. Setting expectations early. At the onset of a project, discussing goals, visions, and processes ensures everyone starts on the same page. This clarity reduces potential points of contention. Regular check-ins. Routine team meetings, one-on-one -on -one sessions, and project status updates can help identify budding issues before they escalate. Team bonding activities. Organizing team bonding activities can foster camaraderie and mutual understanding amongst team members. When individuals know each other beyond their professional roles, they're more likely to collaborate constructively. Feedback mechanisms. Implementing anonymous feedback systems can provide insights into latent issues, allowing leaders to address concerns proactively. Personal attributes of leaders in conflict resolution. The success of conflict resolution strategies often hinges on the personal attributes of the leaders implementing them. Here's what effective leaders in the gaming industry often exhibit. Empathy. Understanding and generally caring about team members' perspectives is foundational to resolving disagreements. Patience. Conflicts don't resolve overnight. Leaders need the patience to navigate the complexities and nuances of each disagreement. Assertiveness. While understanding is essential, leaders must also be assertive when making final decisions to ensure projects stay on track. Strong communication skills. The ability to convey thoughts clearly, without ambiguity, is vital in ensuring everyone understands the resolution. And open-mindedness. Leaders should be willing to change their stance when presented with compelling arguments or new information. Post-conflict. Building stronger bonds. How leaders handle the aftermath of a conflict can shape the team's future dynamics. And here's what can be done. Reflect on the cause. Understand the root cause of the conflict to prevent reoccurrence. This might involve revisiting processes, roles, or communication channels. Rebuild trust. Conflicts can strain relationships. Engage in trust-building activities. Acknowledge everyone's contributions and ensure that there's no lingering animosity. Document learnings. Every conflict offers a learning opportunity. Documenting these can serve as a guide for future situations and also for new team members. Celebrate resolutions. Recognize and celebrate the team's ability to navigate disagreements and emerge stronger. This positive reinforcement can change the team's perspective of conflicts from being detrimental to growth opportunities. Challenges in implementing conflict resolution strategies. While the strategies outlined are ideal, the real world presents challenges in their implementation. Hierarchy barriers. In some organizations, strict hierarchies can hinder open communication. Leaders must work to fly on these structures, promoting open dialogue. Resource constraints. Investing in training, team building activities, or hiring mediators requires resources. Leaders need to advocate for these, emphasizing their long-term benefits. Resistance to change. Not everyone is open to new strategies or changes in processes. Leaders should approach such individuals empathetically, understanding their concerns and showcasing the benefits of change. Final thoughts. 
The video game industry, with its blend of creativity and technology, is ripe for conflicts. But these disagreements, when navigated effectively, can lead to stronger bonds, innovative solutions, and a harmonious work environment. As leaders in the dynamic industry, mastering conflict resolution is not just a skill, it's a responsibility. It's about ensuring that every voice is heard, every perspective valued, and every team member treated with respect. In doing so, leaders don't just resolve conflicts, they sculpt the very culture of their organizations, turning challenges into opportunities for growth and innovation. All right. And that's this week's episode of Press Start Leadership Podcast. Thanks for listening. And as always, thanks for being awesome. Oh, hi there. The episode's over, but thanks for sticking around till the end. If you're on the quest to elevate your team's leadership, production, or game design capabilities, I'm here to assist. Leveraging extensive experience and a strategic approach, I offer personalized audits, bespoke workshops, and leadership retreat facilitation to drive your team toward excellence. My commitment is to provide efficient, reliable, and proven support, ensuring you have the tools and insights needed to thrive. Ready to unlock your team's full potential and achieve unparalleled success? Don't hesitate to press start on your journey to transformation today. Feel free to reach out directly to discuss how we can tailor a solution to meet your unique needs and goals. Let's connect and take your team's performance to the next level.